Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video and this one is on how to play the Crown Tundra DLC. I was supposed to upload it yesterday but I couldn't find any links until some people in my Discord, shout out to you, told me that 128BitBay had the links to them. Shout out to them, big thank you. Go check out their Discord. And for the people who came from the Isle of Armor DLC video, link down below by the way if you don't have that yet. This is basically the follow up of that video and I'll just be showing you how to install this DLC. So if you want to know how to get the game and get other games as you can see from the screen, watch the other guide for the actual game, link down below as well. Now of course all the links are down in the description, but if one of them doesn't work for you, join my Discord server and join my Discord server anyway to chat etc and hang out with me. Without further ado, subscribe, we're on the road to 20k before 2020 ends. Uh, I'm helping you, help me out please, thank you. And uh, yeah, like the video if this worked and comment down below if it worked because then other people can tell if it's real or not. Alright, enough talk, let's get right into the video. Alright, so we have our Yuzu as we know it. As I said, if you don't have these games or anything, check out one of my tutorials. The more recent, the better. Because I've also been getting a lot of uh, configure questions. I'll make a controller configure guide, alright? For now, check out the Breath of the Wild tutorial, I showed it there. Just like in the previous DLC video, as you can see I already have the Crown Tundra installed, but the update wasn't here yet, and that's what we're gonna install today. So, you just go to the top left of your Yuzu, you're gonna click Install Files to NAND. Alright, and here you're gonna look for your files. Now, an important thing to note is that for Pokemon Sword, you have a different file than for Pokemon Shield, because the games are just a tiny bit different with Pokemon and... Yeah, so let's say a Pokemon Shield update will not work on Pokemon Sword. So make sure you get the right links and download the right ones before you comment down below telling me it doesn't work. Alright, so now that's out of the way. I normally play Pokemon Sword, so I'm just gonna look for Sword. But I think you can select multiple, so if you play Sword and Shield, you can just select them both and click open. And it will say, please confirm these are the files you wish to install. And installing an update or DLC will overwrite the previous installed one. Now, obviously we want that in this case, so we click install. And it will say that's installing. So just wait for this. And yeah, after that I'll show you how to actually get to, well, the Crown Tundra. Alright, so after that's done, it will say two files were overwritten. Just click OK. It will refresh this list. As you can see, it says update. 